So when talking about molecular biology, one important concept here is the breaking down and building up of molecules throughout. This is what's happening all the time in all of our cells. And altogether, these collected metabolic reactions are actually called metabolism. So it's all the chemical reactions that are taking place in the cytoplasm of the cell and in other specific organelles. For example, in these mitochondria for cellular respiration and in the chloroplasts in plants when they're doing photosynthesis. So metabolism is the web of all enzyme catalyzed reactions. So a lot of kind of units are going to be introduced in this like general overview of what metabolism is all about. So enzyme catalyzed reactions, if you know anything from your grade nine or grade 10 or earlier studies in biology, you know that enzymes are considered to be biological catalysts. They are little protein molecules that will help to speed up reactions. And almost every reaction that happens in the body has a specific enzyme to help us do that particular job. So in general, you can see here, we are building blocks up. And in this case, I think what I was trying to show is that we're breaking things down. Depends on which way you're looking at this particular puzzle. But metabolism can be split into two types of metabolism. In general, we have anabolism. Anabolism, if I think of A meaning add, I think of adding smaller bits together to make larger molecules. So anytime we're synthesizing complex molecules from simpler molecules, we call that anabolism. It's a type of metabolism where we're building up molecules. So we're forming large molecules. Another fancy word for large is macro. So a large molecule is a macro molecule by a process called condensation. And you'll see more about this later. But in general, condensation is the method by which you make you add two things together to make them into a larger piece. And uh, it just so happens that a water molecule comes off. But you'll see that in more detail in one of the subsequent videos. Another way, if you can add things to make them bigger, you can also break them down or go opposite and go down this direction. Or as my puzzle pieces are showing, I'm taking those away. So this is called catabolism. And if you think of subtract and act somehow sounds like catabolism. So catabolism is the breaking down of larger molecules. The opposite of condensation is something called hydrolysis. So hydrolysis of macromolecules to monomers. So monomers is a fancy word to say, you know, individual Lego pieces. So if here is one little monomer, if I add two monomers together, I am therefore uh, adding them to make a larger molecule. But in this case, catabolism is about breaking down these larger molecules into smaller molecules, breaking down of complex molecules into simpler molecules, or breaking down of macromolecules into monomers and condensation and hydrolysis are opposite reactions. You'll be talking about that next.